Well, good morning, everybody. It's me, Mitch. It's a beautiful morning. It's the 4th of July. It's the 4th of July. And I thought, doesn't seem like a holiday to me. Maybe because it's on a Thursday. I heard fireworks a little last night, but for some reason this doesn't feel, doesn't feel like the fourth to me. And I'm trying to figure out why, I'm trying to figure out why, what's missing. The fourth of July is a patriot's holiday. It's always been about America. It's always been about the red, white, and blue. It's been about celebrating freedom. It's been about honoring those that have sacrificed so that we could have these freedoms. And interestingly enough, Like so many other holidays, the 4th of July has lost, has lost its meaning because in our country today, and not meaning to delve into, into the politics, in our country today, patriotism doesn't seem to reign anymore. We're a country full of America haters. We're a country full of people whining about everything, how unfair it is that they're being treated the way they are, whining and complaining and making videos, making videos. We're being gaslit from every direction. We're being gaslit from the political parties. We're being gaslit by the food companies and drug companies. My favorite expression lately has become, don't believe your lion eyes. We see things with our own eyes and they tell us we're stupid and we don't understand what we're really seeing. They insult our collective intelligence on a daily basis. And yet, and yet, today, July 4th, we're supposed to forget all that. Go out and spend a ton of money on fireworks, shoot them up in the air, make a lot of noise. And we don't even know why. <laughs> and ironically, I'm going to tell you why, in case you don't know. I'm going to tell you why you're celebrating the 4th of July. You're celebrating the 4th of July to eat crap and get drunk and be rowdy. Don't delude yourselves. People about the motives. Don't delude yourself about the motives of why you're celebrating. Oh, and you like the day off. Don't tell me it's about patriotism for a lot of you. It's about an excuse, an excuse to stuff your face with addictive foods, to drink more than your share of addictive liquids like alcohol and beer and everything else, sweet, sugary, soft drinks. Party like there's no tomorrow. Claim the next day off tomorrow because, well, it falls between Thursday, July 4th, and the weekend. So we'll just make a long weekend of this. We'll just party for four days, and then, of course, we'll be useless on Monday because we're going to have a four day drunk to get over. And that's the problem, unfortunately, right now. We are used to living in a world that has no grasp of reality anymore, and it's a shame. So that's why on this July 4th, although I would much rather come out here 
and talk about patriotism and talk about love of country, a country that I served many years ago when things weren't as bad as they were now. They were, they were bad in the Vietnam era. We had our radicals and we had our protests. Nothing like the state of our world today. Complaining about it does no good. We are so mired in this and we're trying to find that little merry band of carnivores that we are trying to find an answer and a way to just coexist with a world that doesn't want us around, doesn't want us spreading our ideas because it interferes with their eating and drinking and gaslighting. Oh, and making profits. I wish I could be more optimistic and happier today. We need to continue doing what we're doing. It may be a holiday, but I'm still having my private community live stream tonight. I doubt that I'll be participating in any drinking, gorge fest eating of sugar and crap, firing off fireworks, endeavoring to set somebody on fire. It's going to be another normal day for me because honestly, this holiday, unfortunately, has no traditional or real meaning for me anymore. On a brighter note, and I'd like to end this on a brighter note, our private community is growing. We are up to 142 members. And I hope to see a lot of you in the live stream tonight, 7 p.m. Thursday, July the 4th. You can come and join us. There'll be a link for you. And I, as always, look forward to Thursday nights where I can get together with some really smart, nice, honest people who I'm proud to know. Until then, take the rest of the day off and eat meat.